Not getting much coverage. I should look for more towers to activate. Okay, MJ. I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay. Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the security room to unlock it. He'll never survive this. Next election, he'll get destroyed. Maybe. I've seen Osborne survive worse. He is a cockroach. There's the security room, but that guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. Left my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. The health emergency might do it. Really? Come on, let's go talk to security. Hey, let us back upstairs. I've got a medical emergency here. Oh man, I can't breathe. Let me back upstairs. Oh, every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague. Definitely stay away from the receptionist been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs! Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. That should do it. Oh, crap. Jerry, get out of here. We got a situation. Get out here right now! We're just Security the room's open. Osborne. Just need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. Hello. Man, I, I, set it down. I know a few Sable agents who would love to meet you. Wear your way out of here. We're in charge now. Okay, okay, I'm gone. multi-billion dollar building with network speeds from 1995. <laughs> Ridiculous. Oh, clear. Repeat. <laughs> I like this thing. Gotta turn him around. Good boy. I'm sure Sable offers workman's comp. Elevator controls in the security room. Next to the Sable agent. Mary Jane Watson? Super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. That did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Penthouse elevator. This is it. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Find the alarm. Stupid useless button. Hmm. Guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. Warning. Fire doors engaged. Automated 
Self-diagnostic commencing. Please remain calm. Scientific journals debating the Spider-Man problem. <laughs> so weird there's a whole cottage industry focused on explaining Pete's power. MJ, Sable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. Work order for keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. Doors are locked till the system check finishes. What is this thing? Hmm. Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. Whoa. This mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? I wonder where it leads. The fabulous Norman bids his son farewell. Huh. This must be from when Harry left for Europe last year. Why was Norman so dramatic about a trip to Europe? Secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. Be back any minute. Need to find that keypad code. Harry's last day. I know he left last summer, but Norman locked up Harry's room. Wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. But where did he put the key? <sighs> Forgot about this. The Osbournes have a coat of arms and a motto. Pax in Bello, peace in war. <sighs> Gotta remember that if I ever write a book about all of this. Harry said his mom used to cook all the time. I'd be surprised if Norman has ever even touched the stove. This room smells like rich people. Wonder if all this wine is from Norman's vineyard in Burgundy. Michael's for one last shot before the, um, the big trip. Um, uh, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, anyway. Listen, I know I don't say this enough, but thank you, Dad. You know, 
for doing this. I love you. Wow. Haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so... tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. Look at all this. Norman certainly likes to remind guests of his status. A photo was removed, though. Wonder what was there. Harry's room. But it's locked. I wonder where Norman keeps the key. Norman and Otto. Wow. They look like they used to be so close. What could have ruined a friendship like this? Emily's terminal diagnosis. I know Harry's mom was sick, but I had no idea it was genetic. Did Harry ever get tested? Happy birthday, dear. Sorry, I'm a little late. It's been a busy month. I miss you, Em. Especially today. I've put Harry... I've sent him away. For treatment. We'll fix him, Em. I promise. Development of GR-27 was too slow to save you. It won't fail, Harry. I'm keeping his room exactly as it is, ready for when he gets back. The key is with you, Em. I know you keep it safe. Wait. Norman sent Harry away for treatment? I thought he went to Europe on his own. What were you hiding from us, Harry? I used to be so jealous of Harry's family. They were so happy. At least compared to me and my dad. But when Emily got sick, everything changed. Pete and I loved coming over here to watch movies when we were kids. A different world from Queens. <laughs> Funny how Harry always wanted the opposite. Nothing made him happier than watching cartoons on the little TV in May's kitchen. Harry's mom, Emily. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might- Feels like there's something attached to the back of the frame. for Harry, can it?
Law books. Harry wants to be an environmental attorney. Like his mom. Why didn't you tell us you were sick? Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room. I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here. The antiserum is ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Keep Team 2 on standby. I'm getting some air. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. Control, grid's clear. Repeat, grid's clear. Control. Control. Okay, July 18. Bingo. Super creepy. God, what are these things? Prototype hand grenades? Norman wins the fancy map contest. Looks like the Upper West Side. Looks like Norman's tracking Dr. Michael's movements. Creep fest. <sighs> Kinda makes sense, though. Michael's is the lead on Devil's Breath. Huh. This shows all of Oscorp's properties. 
had no idea they owned so much of New York. Sable troop deployments. They're stationed all over the city. I bet I can find the Devil's Breath Lab with this. It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of Sable protection, frequented by Dr. Michaels. Bet I'm looking for a heavily guarded Oscorp building that Dr. Michaels visits. Where do these three categories overlap? That must be the lab's location. Nope, that's just a Sable patrol. Bet I'm looking for a heavily guarded Oscorp building that Dr. Michaels visits. Norman Osborne, GR-27 research log. The whole project has gone to hell. GR-27 is a cure, not a disease. But try telling that to the evening news. Somehow, they've picked up the technician's morbid nickname, Devil's Breath, and are using it to stoke hysteria. They have no idea what it's really capable of. A cure for cancer, genetic disorders, birth defects. With just a little more research, I know we could perfect it. Instead, I'll spend the next 18 months on PR mop-up. What a waste of time. Devil's Breath isn't a disease. Harry and Emily's medical records. GR-27 was developed to treat them. Devil's Breath is a failed cure for Norman's own family. scientist thing going on. Looks like a map of the Upper West Side. None of these patrols cross Dr. Michael's path. Oscorp building, but no Michaels or Sable. That's not it. Where do these three categories overlap? That must be the lab's location. Dr. Strom, isn't he a robotics expert? Commercial buildings, bravo, bravo, bravo. And this must be the C team. Wow, so many, where do these three categories overlap? No movement from Dr. Van Adder. Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath team. Wherever the anti good old alpha team, Devil's Breath should check the patrol route. Oscorp's go, no. A records facility could be perfect cover for the devil. No, I need to track Michaels. Ben Adder, Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath team. Wherever Oscorp's going all in on defense research. Good ol' Alpha team. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big Sable presence. No, a records facility could be GR-27. That's the code name for Devil's Breath. This is it. Tenth and Cathedral. Isn't that... I knew it. Tenth and Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. <laughs> Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR27 Martin Lee incident. What is this? And we are rolling. I will be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. <laughs> Oh my god. Norman 
and Otto. They started all of this. They created Lee. I, I have to get this. Who's there? Oh, no. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Damn it. We have a breach. High alert. Pete, I've got the lab location. And a lot more. How far away are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. Need to clear that balcony. You're amazing. <laughs> it's all so much to take in. Harry sick, Norman and Lee, and Dr. Octavius? I know. This is all my fault. No, not this song again. You are not alone anymore, Pete. Let Miles and me look after Feast. You... you find Norman. You find the cure. Thanks. Partner. to get that anti-serum and start putting things right. There must be some way to reach Leonardo. Convince them to give up this crusade for revenge. They've both done so much good for the world. They can't throw their legacies away just to spite Norman. <laughs> <laughs> 